What's up guys, in this short tutorial I will show you how to boost your FPS and overall performance when playing World of Warcraft on your PC. This should be quite an easy tutorial, everything you need will be listed in the description below. First we will take a look at your in-game settings. Open up World of Warcraft and navigate to your graphic settings. Here set the display mode to full screen. I have set it to windowed as it's easier to record. Set the window size option to your native monitor resolution. In case you're using an abnormal screen resolution, as I am, then feel free to set it to 1920x1080. Set the monitor option to the monitor you wish to use and disable anti-aliasing and vSync. Make sure to set the resolution scale to 100%. In case none of the other tweaks helped you out as much as you wanted, then consider reducing your render scale option to around 90%. This will in any case reduce the visual quality, but your performance will increase by a lot. In your base settings, set the texture resolution option to fair or low, depending on your GPU. Spell density to half. Enable projected textures. Set the view distance option to around 7, which is the default value. Below, I suggest setting the environment detail and ground clutter options to 1. In case you have some performance to spare, then feel free to increase these settings later on. On your right side, set the shadow quality to low, liquid detail to fair, disable sun shafts, set the particle density option to low, SSAO to low, disable depth of field, and disable the outline mode. After applying your changes, make sure to enable the rate and better ground settings option. Here, you should reduce these options quite a bit, as these will be applied when in a raid or battleground. Reduce your spell density, liquid detail and other effects options before applying your changes. In your advanced settings, enable triple buffering. Set the texture filtering option to 2 times anisotropic. Disable ray traced shadows. Set the ambient occlusion type to auto detect. Disable MSAA. Enable multi-sample alpha test and disable the post-processing AA and resample quality options. Below, make sure to set the graphics API option to the highest DirectX version you can set it to. In my case, it's DirectX 12. Set the graphics option to your main GPU and then, on the right side, make sure to set the maximum foreground FPS to a value above your screen's refresh rate, but below the maximum FPS you can get. Below, change the brightness, contrast and gamma options to your own preference. When this is done, leave the game running and open up your task manager. Here in the processes tab, right click World of Warcraft and select to go to details. In the details tab, the wow.exe application should be highlighted. Simply right click it and set the priority to high. This will in turn allocate more resources to playing the game and should increase your performance especially if you have other programs running in the background. In order to reduce the CPU utilization from other programs, I suggest you to end some programs from running in the background, which you don't need when playing the game. But make sure to only add programs from running, which you know won't break your operating system. In the Startup tab, you can additionally prevent programs from starting up on System Boot. You can now close the game and exit out of your Task Manager. When this is done, search for Game Bar to open up the Game Bar system settings. Here, uncheck the recording option, and in the Captures tab, make sure to additionally disable the background recording option. These settings will only reduce your performance. If you want to record your gameplay, then I suggest using OBS Studio or an external capture card if you lack performance. Next, make sure that your graphics driver is up to date. I suggest using the GeForce Experience application if you're using an NVIDIA GPU, but you can also use the AMD driver suit. Depending on how frequently you're updating your GPU, this tweak can make the biggest difference. In the Drivers tab, simply click on Download and the application will automatically download and install the latest driver. In the Home tab, select Details for World of Warcraft and here on the right side, click on this gear icon in order to optimize your in-game settings for performance with the slider system. You can, in addition, change the display resolution and display mode from here. 
When this is done, search for Update to open up your Check for Updates system settings window. Here, click on Check for Updates and after downloading the latest OS update, make sure to restart your PC. Next, right-click your desktop and select NVIDIA Control Panel. You can do the same step with the AMD driver suit. Here, navigate to Manage 3D Settings and then Program Settings. Select to add a program to customize and then add World of Warcraft from the program list. Below, we will change a few settings. Make sure that the CUDA setting is set to your main GPU. Set the power management mode to prefer maximum performance and set the texture filtering quality to performance. When this is done, search for graphic settings and open up your graphic system settings. On this window, select browse and your file explorer will open up. From here, navigate to the drive on which you saved the game on, program files, World of Warcraft, retail. Make sure to select the WoW application and then add it to the program list. Once it's added, you can change the options of the application so that the graphics preference is set to high performance. Don't forget to apply your changes. Lastly, I suggest deleting your temporary files, as these can induce lag if your hard drive is cluttered. Simply search for percentage temp percentage and hit enter. This folder contains all of your temporary files, saved by your programs that should be deleted. You can safely delete everything in this folder. Some files might remain, so just leave them there. I hope this helped you out. Leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.